So this is the end product of the, of the project. So the, um, the staff that we were working with uh, tested out various iterations of, 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 uh, of tools for us and training packages and um, all sorts of different things to come up with this nice um, desktop published uh, uh, final product. So what's in it? We, in the end, broke down what you should do in terms of implementing a palliative approach into these three key learning modules. Um, the first one is about uh, what, as a manager, you might have to look at, and that's about ACFI, about standards, um, setting up a, a working party, engaging link nurses, so it's, it's more at a manager's uh, level. The second one is um, honing in on those three key processes. We've got some templates in there about how to set up a case conference, you know, a fax form to send to the GP, a care plan to, uh, to complete. So it's all, all there uh, designed for you so that you don't have to reinvent that documentation. It's, it's fairly simple, but it has been tested with the, the nine facilities that we were working with. And then there's the end of life uh, pathway and how to use that. In the clinical care uh, booklet, it's a about assessment, management and documentation of those key symptoms. Um, and the flip charts, which are at the front there, um, are designed for that. And they're designed uh, for care workers. Um, so they've um, 10 minutes they, they take for an RN or a link nurse or a specialist palliative care person to go through those, um, those clinical areas. And as I said, they're really designed for um, just little education sessions at the nurse's station or in a, in a training room. Uh, we did initially uh, start off with um, PowerPoints for people um, and then we discovered that most people don't have a data projector and, um, and if you're going to do a, a training session, you might only have a couple of people um, to actually deliver that training to. And so something that was more flexible was going to work um, better for you. We also have self-directed learning packages. And again, knowing uh, that you have staff who are um, a large number of staff often that work part-time um, and that a self-directed package that they could take home um, or do in a group setting within your facility might work best. So there's packages for, there's two for RNs and ENs, there's an introductory and an advanced, and there's one specifically for care workers. They have little competency tests at the end if you want to um, administer those as a manager. Um, and the RN and the EN ones have um, CPD points attached to them for people's uh, portfolio. There's copies of the guidelines. We use therapeutic guidelines, the clinical sort of um, a Bible uh, that's linked to a lot of the medication uh, things that are in the toolkit, the flip charts, as I say, and then there's some information bro 